So today we're headed out. We're going on our long trip. Well, it's not that long. It's five or six weeks. We're going to be going to Arizona, Lake Powell. We're going to be going to the Grand Canyon. Lots of little things. So we're packing up our stuff right now, getting out of this campsite, and we will be gone. So we're excited. We're just getting ready and filling our tanks with water, filling our extra water tanks. And we're just getting ready to get out on the road. We're really looking forward to getting going. Tammy's on the inside of the rig doing some extra cleaning right now. So we should be out of here shortly before we own this Airstream. A little over two years ago, we owned a Class C uh, RV, 31 foot Jayco. And in all these trips that we had, we always had our dogs. But uh, for those who don't know, uh, both of our dogs have passed away. We've been going through that, but now we have no dogs and it's going to be different types of adventures because now we can go on longer hikes and different things like that. So we're looking forward to doing some adventures that we've not been able to do in the past and we look forward to taking you along with us. We're going to be heading over today, hopefully over to Reno. We're going to be staying at a Cabela's for the night. Then we're going to start heading down 395. So right now we're just getting the rig ready. Um, we have to prep for lots of boondocking. So honestly, we haven't we haven't even scheduled anywhere to stay since we've been out of the boondocking thing for a while, or for at least several months. We got to kind of remember. This is what we need to do. This is what we need to bring. So on and so forth. We've been in this rig for approximately just over two years, and uh, even in that two years, we have to do spring cleaning once in a while, and. We're doing spring cleaning right now, so this, it's kind of like a mess. So you have lots of things where you double up on. You have, you know, 50 pair of socks when you really only need five pairs, and it's just, you know, you carry and bring extra things that you think you'll need, but you don't. So we're going through it. We got a ton of stuff. We are all buttoned up and ready to go. That's hard worker right there. Big time. So we are back on the road again, stayed at our favorite Cabela's in Verde, Nevada. Today we came down to Tuttle Creek Campground. We've stayed here once before. It's about halfway between Reno and Lake Havasu, which Lake Havasu is going to be our first destination on this trip. Their winter fees are only $5 a night. However, they, are, they no longer have water or a dump station for the winter. So. Uh, be prepared for that for winter season. We didn't know that. So. Although it's only five bucks instead of eight bucks. Yeah, you save three dollars and you don't have a dump or water, but that's okay. We, we're okay with that. Um, look at the view. But you, yeah, the view and you have internet access here, which... Well, you don't have internet access. You have a signal. 
whatever internet you can get the internet yeah. cell signal okay whatever you want to call it it's a cell signal i can call my people my people can call me and i can uh i can uh you know watch youtube hey that's good so. and watch movies if we want to anyway so it's been a long day we traveled lots of hours this guy drove a lot i'm sure he's tired poor guy he has a big long day tomorrow too but that's all right so we're gonna pay our five bucks go chill at the rig to Lake Havasu. We got an okay spot. Pretty happy with it. They're just finishing setting everything up. We are chilling in the Arizona sunshine. <laughs> and we're growing. Okay, that's gonna do it for this video. In our next video, we will be hiking in this place here called Sarah's Park, where you'll see adventures like this. Yeah, two minutes into the hike, we're already lost. We're like, uh, are we going the right way? I feel like my boots are slipping. Yeah. You ever seen that uh, show, I Shouldn't Be Alive? Hope you don't get claustrophobic. <laughs> I'm just saying. We visit this bar and grill five miles out in the middle of nowhere that's run on 100% solar. And we visit the world famous London Bridge, which is located in downtown Lake Havasu. Don't ask me why. All right, that's it guys. We'll see you on the next one. Until then, stay safe out there.